All right, let's play peep show because there's nothing funnier than playing peep show. I have to do it. That is just too fucking beautiful to walk here and not record anything. I hope I will be able to smooth out the my steps distortion. What? Either way, we're gonna be just fine. Burn. I think that's the most beautiful of the largest cities in Switzerland. In Switzerland, please so I've been told. Maybe it is true. There is not much to choose from actually. There's Bern, and that's it. Two is just large, that's all. Up ahead. Okay, I take my viewers whenever I go with me. I'm listening to some music that you won't hear but maybe that's just for the better enjoy the raw footage of being in Bern for the first time and just walking around from Konitz to wherever yeah. This is a walk from Konitz or Wubern or whatever they tend to call every neighborhood by another name. Let it be. So I'm going to the train station and I hope to catch a bit of a snack. Meanwhile. Let's see how it goes. Actually, nothing too bad can happen to you in Switzerland. The worst thing that can happen is being shouted at when you throw some wrong trash in the wrong bin or something like that. Other than that, except maybe from Japan, it has its own problems. Switzerland is probably the safest and the most civilized country in the world. If you count being safe and stable and technically advanced, it's civilized. Um, I'm not exactly there, but I'm pretty close to this point of view. So Bern, this is where everyone meets. The German 
speaking folk, the French speaking folk, and the Italian speaking folk. And I doubt that anyone here speaks Romansh. I would suppose that Romansh is spoken within very close communities at some remote place. Otherwise it wouldn't have survived. Right here, most of people that I've seen speak German, which is typical. I will be getting the looks with this GoPro. Such a funny thing, but I don't care. I mean, even if I were to live in Bern, I wouldn't care. Because, you know, freak for life. I just hope I won't be beaten. No, I don't think that's possible. It's just too much effort to beat me up. Maybe just shouted it. I have no idea what Frontex is, but seems to be a lot of people opposing it. Also, I have to speak more clearly and a little bit of voice. Let's try some other voice. Let's try a softer voice. I will have trouble with sounds like V and P or whatever. But I will try to speak softer. I think it will sound better on video. Actually, uh, I think I want to put this music, this walk, because it's very appropriate. Let's just record the name. Oh, this Stonehenge place is Aquanimus Stoic Activation Abundance Whatever Some kind of ethno track shit And we're arriving at some additional celebration of life So I pass that, if I pass that, I would be turning sharp left and then sharp right. Which is not very really efficient, but what can you do? Anyway. Let's see if I can pass through here. I think that's the Google Maps idea. Oh no, sorry. I'm not using Google Maps for walking. I'm using it just for biking. And it doesn't do a job too good at that. So, for walking, I use Apple Maps. As you can see, Apple Maps go with Nice routes here. So there's some button folk. A lot of people 
this love bathing, which is nice. Not much else to do on a sunny hot day like this. I will do it another day. People are going all in that direction because they're swimming the other. The river moves with the direction I'm moving. So, yeah. I hope it will be good for them. exactly as I said it would and there's some folk some with wonderful beds floating around Chile is probably the fastest flowing river of this size that I've seen so far it's nice it's not too cold this time of year so total enjoyment Right, so fortunately got a call, got distracted and went the wrong way, back to the route. Yeah, most of it is quite boring. I think that's the Canton Crest right there. I can see somewhere in the middle, middle left, is the Canton of Zurich, and middle right is the Canton of Bern. And I think I'm right. I might be wrong though. Anyway, who cares? Yeah, you have a lot of cantons. So, when you give people stuff to unite them and to be proud of, I think it works. It works for Switzerland at least. Which is actually the wrong name for this place. This is the Confederation Helvetica. Confederation. Okay. I will probably start looking for a place to eat. Yeah, nice. I'll climb it like this.
and I will hopefully see it in action. It's a pretty small road though, pretty short. Let's see. No, I think I plan it faster than those people on the cable car. the place right yeah okay so I'm sorry this is getting a bit inconvenient so I'm going to turn you off now Getting lost, it's annoying. And this is some guys, attractions already. Okay. at work. It's weird. It's written police on their backs. Usually they spell it polizai. Now it's police. I wonder. Never mind. The police are quite strict here. I'm not sure if you can call, call it oppressive or anything, but they are definitely doing their job and they are very serious about that.
to keep the soil in order. To be the comfortable and safe place that it is. Yeah. Neat. Polizei doing their job. Otherwise, some riffraff may think they own the place. And they walk all over orderly citizens, which is not permitted. Right. Yeah, we're coming to the right sharp right point. And there it will mostly be straight. Out first. This footage is absolutely exclusive. And it can be cut into notes and the ad advert advertisement for burn. Because, you know, I don't see any problems. Do you see problems? I see some constructions which may be problems. I see the roads can be improved a bit. Other than that, I wouldn't say that I see anything I can call problems. Now you can see the ratio between bikes, actual regular bikes, and all other two wheelers combined. That's exactly my impression. People are getting spoiled by electric assistant bikes. Oh, this is great. So nice. Obligatory water stop. Whenever you see a water fountain, you have to drink it. It's the water system. All done. Hydration. Prohibition against dehydration. I think that's what I call the law.
careful, don't smile too much. Which is also kind of good. It keeps your face from getting wrinkles. Otherwise, what would you smile at? If you smile at it. Huh? That's what any gramophone would say to you. Actually, I will cut this piece out. It's not much to see here except for some chestnuts the chestnuts are getting ready they're up there oh quite a lot of chestnut trees there are quite many chestnut trees which are also nice okay now we get to peek behind that fence that we've been walking along till to this point. Let's see what's behind it. Ah, typical. <laughs> <laughs> 